Yes, sir. It was the first day of school in Brockton, and there was one common adjective, excitement. Well, I think that uh, the kids are excited to be back. Some more than others, you know, some still want the summer to continue, but uh, it's a beautiful sunny day here in Brockton. Uh, the Hancock School seems to have everything organized as usual. The question is, you know, are the buses running on time? Um, we have some parents that are a little more upset than their children. It's the first day of school for some of them, and there's a big, uh, you know, emotional uh, uh, strain on some of the parents. But um, I think everything, tears were to a minimum this morning. So I think it's going to be a great school year. take a lot of uh, pains to make sure that our students are going on the right bus and that they arrive home safely. That's actually our number one priority for, the, for day one. Uh, we have made a connect ed call uh, to all the parents to let them know that just for extra assurance to have the students tell us how uh, they're planning on getting home. So they bring in a note, especially for our newest students, they bring in a note to let us know how they're getting home, uh, whether it's in the car line, whether it's on the bus, what bus number, so that way everybody's home safely and we can all sleep well at night. Good morning, North Middle School. Welcome back to our teachers and students. This is Mrs. McCormick. I'm just going to take a couple of minutes to give you a quick overview of our day. I'm learning. Kids keep coming in, as you can see behind me. Uh, and if you're sitting at home watching this, make sure you get your kids in school and registered and enrolled so we can start the year. It's, uh, it's going to be a great year. Uh, a lot of energy yesterday with the adults at our convocation. And uh, we're continuing that through through uh, this whole uh, first week. So uh, look forward to a great year and uh, let's, uh, let's keep going. You just couldn't wait for school to start, right? Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> oh don't! Oh, 11 though, it's all Yay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Happy to be back? Welcome back, hey, welcome doing? back. Come on in, everybody, Happy welcome back. back. There is something very special about the first day of school. Um, it, one of my all-time favorite moments is um, standing at the front outside with them when they're coming in and the kids are happy. We have had the most awesome day. It's been so smooth. Um, the kids are excited and I've been going in and out of classrooms and I, I said to all the kids, everybody glad to be back? And they all go, yes. And I said, you know, I want to go to tonight's school committee and say that every student I talked with said they were glad to be back. And you know what? Honestly, that's really what it's been like. So it's a special day and a great feeling, and we're off to an awesome start. Opening day is always exciting to me because the kids come back excited, the teachers are excited, the building looks great, and it's just this energy that you get when you walk into the building and everybody is happy to be here. You know, they're getting to learn their way around. The kids are like, I don't know where to go, and everybody's helping each other out. So it's just, there's just an energy and a life that comes back into the building on the first day that is just phenomenal. Brockton High is home to a lot of kids, and it's home to a lot of adults, too. It's like a second home. It really is. They're excited because they know when they get here, they're going to be respected. People expect great things from them. They're going to push them to work hard and, and help them establish what goals they have beyond high school and then work to help them get there. This is the end game, you know, and it, it, one of the things they talk about in planning is backwards planning. You know, what's the end goal? Yeah. And the end goal comes in June when everybody, and even for us, the end goal isn't when they walk in the doors as freshmen. It's when they leave in June with a diploma in their hand and go off to college. And in fact, one of the initiatives we started, um, we're doing this year is what we're really trying to push is having everybody college ready, everybody thinking about going to college, and we're even starting it um, right in freshman year, that every day teachers are talking about that with the kids so that they are prepared, they are ready, they are academically sound, and they are heading off because what we really want, all the elementaries and middle schools feed up to us, and then our job is to make sure that they are ready, not just for a diploma, but for life beyond that. And so we want them all ready for college. So it's, a, it's just an exciting time. 